So it's Sunday and I get the wonderful task. Amber asked me if I wanted to do a project and I said sure without knowing what it is. Shame on me for not asking first. Uh, making a calendar. We got a free calendar from a store uh, to make our own little calendar from a website. So I'm um, going to be working on that for a little bit. And um, keeping the boys under control because uh, Amber is at work, church, and she took Viola, and so it's just the boys. Ooh, just the boys. Yeah. Alright, what do you guys got here? Mm. Legos. We are building wow. a city. That's, that's, oh, you're building a city? And guess how many buildings I built? A lot. Queen's Castle. I build animals. You build the animals? Yeah. Plane. But this, I don't also, know what I, I did build it. Shopping star. And also Listen. a lighthouse. Wow. I'm a good builder. Did you know your daddy and Uncle Adam what? used to have a whole Lego city in Nooney and Joe Pa's basement? No. Yeah, we had a forest area. And we had the city area. It was pretty cool. It was really nice that Nooney and Joe Pa let us do that. Yeah. That's got to be fun. Maybe we can ask them to do that. Maybe. To our table. Want the boys with me? Going to run to the grocery store real quick. Pick up uh, some meat, chicken, and uh, uh, not meat, chicken, and snack type stuff for uh, lunches because we were kind of running low and running out of snack foods uh, for the kids. So, things to do, things to do. Oh, uh, I did um, get the calendar done, at least remotely done. I don't know if Amber is going to want to change any of it picture wise or um, add anything whatever she wants to add to it so it's up to her and all that good stuff so at least it's done and now when I get back maybe I can work a little bit more on um, my flyer thing for our family fitness site so we're done getting the groceries of course, no trip on a Sunday is complete until we stop for our Sushies! And back to work I go on our, um, right now, so back to work I go on the parent flyer for our school. I'm working on it. I've kind of changed some things up a little bit, uh, I think maybe tonight I might do a, 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 a picture of it and post it to Twitter. So if you're watching this and curious what it's looking like, go check my Twitter feed. I uh, kind of get an idea. Um, uh, uh, instead of a section on here, websites like they can go to to get some... Uh, to, I'm trying to find something for them to like a log or creating a log or something for their family. So I'm trying to find some websites. Uh, you know, I've got my YouTube channel with the dances, um, Go Noodle, uh, Let's Move, a Active Schools, their little part on there. And so I want some websites for them to go to to kind of help out too. And so I'm using a QR code for that section as, along with the app section for the handout. I'm going to do QR codes. It's just because it'll be easier instead of them having to go type, you know, you know how it's, everything's all funky. C O N two three nine six instead of typing all out, they could just use a QR code. It's Monday, and obviously, I'm on my way home. So I did the uh, QR code. I am tired. I apologize. QR code dances with our second through fifth graders, uh, which was basically scanning the QR code. And I had it linked to the my dance videos that are in my my Google Drive, and most of them worked, and some of them did not. We had some problems with uh, it reading to the drive, and I don't know if it was the Wi-Fi in the gym, if it was everybody trying to connect to my Google Drive, or whatnot. So it kind of worked, kind of did not work. Uh, it just kind of depended on how it was scanned and what was scanned and all that good stuff so it was um wasn't bad the kids i think enjoyed kind of doing that kind of aspect something a little different so now i'm on the way to the store grab a couple groceries and then um, uh, 
head on home. Finally on my way home. As you can tell, it gets dark pretty quick. Uh, got everything I needed in the grocery store. Uh, almost forgot the main reason why I was going, which was to get uh, stuff for the chili cook-off, chili celebration for the Super Bowl that we're going to do at our school on Friday. Uh, I kind of told the team that, oh, okay, I'll make it. Can't guarantee they'll like it, but because uh, I put all kinds of beans and stuff in it. and It doesn't always look good and it doesn't always taste good it doesn't really taste like chili but it's a lot of lot of protein in it with the different beans that i use and um the meat of course you know ground beef i probably should have gotten two pounds oh well i think there's enough beans in there that'll kind of supplement for it i just can't remember too what i use for a base i don't think it was a paste i don't think it was sauce um i golly i wish i can remember because i kind of like mine a little bit thicker so I think I got pur puree, puree, purtee, I don't know. Some kind of tomato sauce type stuff. But I think sauce is too, um, it's not, it's not, I don't want to say too watery. But yeah, it's like real thin. And I like it a little bit thicker. So I think what I'm going to do with this chili is I'm going to um, kind of take the meat out. And kind of put the some seasoning in with the meat and stuff. And let it kind of uh, soak into the meat, I guess. Whatever you call it, marinade in the meat and then cook that later this week but i'm gonna i won't do that i won't marinate it until like the day i'm gonna cook it see if that works on my chili i've never tried it so we'll soon find out <laughs> i lost him oh there he goes so hey come here how come you're up and everybody else is sleeping because well, i have going to bed Good day. Oh, you did you doing a good job this morning being responsible mm -hmm. today? Yep. What did you do right when you came home from school? I did my homework. Nice. Wait a minute. Is that on your ninja to-do list? Yeah. Oh, they, he sliced you guys. Oh, another slice in there. Oh. Oh. Ready? Think it, but oh, he tried to block it. Ready? Oh, good, good block. Oh, he forgot to kick. He forgot to block the kick. Well, it is Tuesday, and uh, I'm pretty exhausted. Uh, I just, uh, I don't know what it is. I, I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm beat down, worn out today. That's for sure. Uh, the lesson today went a uh, lot better, I think, for our iPad activity the qr dance stuff i think went a lot better today than it did before uh it seemed like a lot of the videos pulled up a lot quicker and pulled up easier than it did on monday so hopefully so here comes a yawn <sighs> sorry hopefully i'll be able to uh keep that going and everything uh we talked about getting some external speakers for uh plugging in the headphone jack and, and using it that way and having a little bit louder so they can hear uh, and there's a store I'll probably try to hit at some point in time uh, if I can uh, to look at getting those and trying them out and seeing if they work so anyway now it's just the evening time You can tell he's the only one. <laughs> this is the second week in a row he's been the only one in class. So, so Roman, how was that shower tonight? Cold. Cold. Pilot went out. Someone had a very bone chilling shower, but somebody had a very hot shower. I think. <laughs> The pilot was out, but he used all the hot water because when I came in there, the everything fogged over and it was real hot. So I think Sander used it all. Needs to say, pilot's relit. Probably be a little while before we get hot water. <laughs> so I wanted to take a moment and show you the uh, speakers I picked up to hook to our iPads so that when the kids are doing our uh, activity this week, um, they can actually hear the dances. Because right now with those iPads, you know, can't hear anything that's playing in the video. 
And so I uh, found a store that had some of these uh, cheap speakers, $5 for these. Uh, they're battery operated. Uh, this one actually they pulled out and let me listen to and it had pretty, I was impressed with the sound. And same with this one, pretty impressed with the sound that this one put out. Um, and uh, yeah, they're, we'll see how long they last if the quality's been okay. I mean, uh, the only thing downfall is the volumes controlled via your phone so I can, or iPad or whatever you hook it up to. So I'm at the mercy of how loud the actual videos are going to be when they're being played. So we'll see what happens, uh, how loud they show. Hopefully it'll be loud enough for them. They're going to be scattered anyway. So a place I got them at, I have to shout out because I couldn't believe the price and, and the deal is, uh, oh man, I can't think of it. Five five below five below is the name of it so i don't know if you got one near you but um hey and I, i'm waiting for those towers they said they should be getting some more at some point so i, I think i might down the road purchase some more to have because i think uh, those are better the sound wise uh more sound comes out of them than the, the smaller ones so we'll see how it goes tomorrow so um the letter for the parents to sign up uh information letter for our fitness nice done got done today uh, got it approved, so I'm just kind of going to uh, make a couple minor changes and then uh, send it out probably next week. I'm still working on my handout for that night, but I still got a good couple weeks before I need to send that to the copy center and get it approved. Get it approved first, then send it to the copy center. So, But uh, that's pretty much the excitement for this vlog. I hope that you have enjoyed it, especially the part where Xander and you all were up. Having a karate match. As always, thank you for subscribing, commenting, liking, and sharing the videos. I'm Coach Perola reminding you to keep on moving.